You're going down. You're going. You're going freaking down. You are going down. Hi. Hi. Oh. 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 We got slapped. He got slapped. <laughs> if you wanna make Moola and you wanna be a ruler, there ain't no time soon. To subscribe to my page in the future. And you will be screaming hallelujah. Hey yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to another brand new video on the TG channel. Guys, in today's video we're going to be playing some superpower training simulator because of course it is at the top of the Roblox game page and we just can't- Whoa, rank up. Hang on a second. Oh wow, I just got murked bro. I just got duppied. Okay, well, we'll just pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> guys, if you happen to be enjoying this video, make sure you leave a massive, massive like and also I want you to do something really, really- just- here, here, here's a little game we're gonna play. Comment 10 facts about yourself down below right now, each fact in a separate comment. So comment one fact, then press send. Comment another fact, then press send. Do that 10 times, and whoever gets my attention the most, or happens to, I don't know, get picked in the next video, will, of course, get themselves a shout out. And speaking of shout outs, massive, massive shout out to you, and a massive, ma wow. Shout out to you. <laughs> Let's get straight on into this bang of a video, guys. Okay, so right off the bat, 20 out of 20 movement speed. Okay, ooh, how do we? Oh, you just have to move. Oh, sick, and then jump. Oh my goodness. Okay, guys, I'm gonna be right back, okay? I'm gonna get this quest finished. I'm gonna meet back with you guys once I've actually got a little bit more, I don't know, speed on my, under my belt, a little bit more power on, in my fists, and I don't know, a little bit more, a little bit more jump on my feet. I'll be right back a sec, guys. Awesome stuff. 20 out of 20 movement speed. 20 out of 20 jump ability. Let's see what we... Click here to talk. Okay. Now we will talk about the most important thing. The mind. You probably don't know that psychic powers are real. I, I didn't know that psychic powers are real, actually. <laughs> For example, with a strong enough mind, one can become in... What? One can become invisible or create an illusion to attack other people, mind and soul. Even crush and kill them just by looking at them from a far distance. Also, it can lift one abo up above the, s the ground or even fly to the sky. And the most simple and efficient way to train it is by meditation. If you don't believe what I said, then come back when you have at least 100 psychic power. And I'll tell you how to use your psychic power to become invisible. Invisibility is the easiest psychic move to learn. Right now, you can't learn any psychic moves. Your mind is too weak. Alright. All right, I'll, I'll show you freaking psychic moves. How do I meditate then? I need... Wait. Oh my goodness. Do I just literally sit here? I don't, I don't want that guy to come for me, to be fair. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna sit here. Uh, I'm gonna, just, no, no, oh man, oh my god. Why me, man? Why me? Every single freaking time. <laughs> ah, okay, so after some time of sitting in a corner of some room, just doing nothing, I apparently have 100 psychic power. Here we go, talk to Saf. Congratulations, now you can become invisible anytime you want to, just by pressing T. Okay, but keep in mind that you can't hide from people with higher psychic power. Also, you will lose your invisibility state when you launch any of your attack- Lunch any of your attack moves, what a guy. And you will not be completely invisible. Now, I want to teach you a move called Energy Sphere Punch. You must have at least 1,000 fist strength. Or else it will just become a normal punch. There is a big stone just over there. Now, you have enough power to use it. Just keep punching on it and you will have 1,000 strength in no time. Okay, sweet. Alright, cool. All right, I'm just gonna go- I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna go punch. Just, did I just punch it? Oh wow. Wait. Oh boy. Oh, oh, that's that's some good XP. Okay. Well, oh, oh, guys, I'll be back. I'll be back. I'll be back in a in a sec. Uh. <laughs> Alright. Good. From now on, you can just press R to execute the energy sphere punch. Okay, goody. Also, the size and the color of the energy sphere will sometimes change. The more fist strength you have, the stronger and larger it will become. Now, the next move I'll teach you is the damage reflection. When your body toughness is higher than your opponent's fist strength, you'll be able to reflect their damage back to attack themselves. But in most cases, the damage you reflect will not be fatal to the attacker. Because if your body toughness is just a little higher than their fist strength, then you're only going to reflect about 10% of the damage. And other 9% will just still hurt you. Okay, cool. So to reflect 100% of the damage back to the attacker and receive zero damage, you will need a body toughness 10 times higher than the opponent's fist strength. A very strong body is necessary to launch. To launch. <laughs> this guy, man. <laughs> to launch this move, or at least 1,000 body toughness. I'll tell you some secrets. Do you know the city port? If not, you can find it just by crossing the bridge over there. In the city port, they had some secret body training technologies in there. Training in there is so much more effective than the push up. But be careful, you could easily die in there, so don't push yourself 
too much. This is freaking dramatic. Oh my goodness. You can come back to me when your body isn't is strong enough. Now go. I need to get some rest. Turn on my auto training bot game pass. Uh, auto training bot game pass? Is that a thing? How do I find that? Wait a minute. Auto bot. I don't know. But speaking of game passes, has he got like double XP? Can I buy double XP, guys? No, there's no double XP. Uh, it's just VIP for now. Times two rewards. But does that times two token purchases and times two rewards? But I'm not sure if times two rewards is double XP. I, okay, I'm not gonna buy it just yet, just in case it's like a. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not gonna. No, I'm not not too sure. Also, codes. Have we got any codes for this game yet, guys? That is a good good question. I'm gonna set in. Uh, hang on a setting. Hello. I'm gonna settings. That makes. Sense. <laughs> oh mate, I need some sleep. <laughs> okay, settings. Um, there's no actual codes in the game yet, which leads me to believe, of course, guys, every single simulator game is gonna have codes eventually. So you heard it here first. I'm gonna leak. The fact that they're gonna have codes very very soon in their new update coming very very soon to the game if it's not this next update it'll be the one after and if it's not that it will definitely be the one after that because trust me developers are not stupid especially simulator developers they know 100% guys what is this they know 100% that uh oh games reborn oh wow own it oh boy own it oh my goodness own it it's like the top wow okay i got murked I got absolutely murked. Guys, you already know, simulator games always have codes, and if this game doesn't have codes yet, which I don't think it does, it's definitely going to have codes very, very soon. But this, obviously, this isn't the time for codes right now. Obviously, we haven't got the setting to use it, so let's just not even bother waffling about that. That being said, train body toughness, 118 out of 1,000. I'm going to be back with you guys once we've actually got to this place, this city poor place. I don't know what the heck that is. Um, I'm just going to, like, instant transmission there or something, because... Oh, we're lost. All right, guys, I think we found something. I think we found City Port, but whereabouts in the City Port? You said there was a secret spot somewhere. Just not too sure whereabouts. Uh, oh, okay, we have the one to fall into there. Maybe if I just train in, nope, that doesn't work. Okay, up here. Ooh, ooh, hello, hello, hello. I see something. I see someone up here. Hang on a second, guys. I need to walk, because, uh, can I get in there? Oh my goodness. Hang on a second, how do I do it? No, 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 okay, that doesn't obviously do anything. Can I? Okay, I can get him. What the heck is this? I see you. No, 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 please. Please don't hurt me. I come in peace. Please, I just want to train, man, please. Requires 10,000 body toughness. What the heck? Hi, sir. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna be really, really friendly to this person because I don't want to get murked. Requires 100 plus body toughness. So that means we can get in here now. We can get into this ice bath. Oh wow. Oh boy, this is training us very, very quickly. Guys, I'ma just enjoy my little ice bath here. I don't know what this is, ice bath, hot tub, whatever the heck this is. I'ma be back two seconds, maybe a couple hours. I'm just kind of comfy in here. One eternity later. Okay, so <laughs> I'm just gonna slowly, slowly walk my way over to Saf right here. Hopefully I don't get blasted in the forehead because I'm not trying to feel some pain right now. Click here to talk. Great, and don't worry, it's a passive skill, so you don't have to execute it every time. This means that with the skill enabled, it will auto reflect all damages for you. Let's continue our lessons. Do you remember the water walking joke I told you? Well, you. Okay, I, I, I knew he'd say that. He's not joking. <laughs> Actually, you can really walk on water, but you just need to run very fast to do it. I have some training tips for you. I know that it's hard to control when we really run fast. However, you can make all of your movements slower by putting more weight on your body. Equip it by pressing 4 and choose the weight you would like to, to use. Okay, but don't put too much weight on your body because it will be too heavy to even move. And come see me when you have at least 1,000 movement speed and 1,000 psychic power. Ah, oh, sweet. So if I put 100 tons on... Alright, let me unequip it. What if I put 10 tons? Okay, I'm too weak for that. Okay, nope, okay. What about 1 ton? Oh, 1 ton's pretty good. 1 ton's pretty lit. So how do I train with it? How do I do it? Wait, train movement speed. Is it supposed to do something? Okay, unequip. 100. Ah, oh, I see. Oh! I see 10 tons. What about 10 tons? <gasps> Oh! What about 100 tons? 20 movement speed per tick. Guys, I'm gonna be right back. I figured this out. I'm gonna be right back. Oh god, leave me alone! Leave me alone! Nope, not today, buddy. Not today, buddy. You're going down. You're going You're going freaking down. You are going down. Hi! Hi! Oh! 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 He got slapped! He got slapped! 
No, leave me! Leave me alone! Oh my goodness! Oh, oh my god! Oh, leave me! Please, okay, uh, he's leaving me alone. Guys, guys, 1,000 movement speed, done. Train psychic power, 1,000 now, 1,000, done. They're gonna get 200, I don't know these, let's just call them skull tokens. We're gonna call them skull tokens. If you have a better name for them, let me know down below in the comment section, guys, right now. What should we call them? But right now, I'm just gonna call them skull tokens because I don't know what the heck they are. Uh, they just look like skulls and they come in more than one of quantity. So let's just call them skull tokens. All right, 1,000 psychic power, 1,000 movement speed. Um, how do I check what my skill? <gasps> okay, here we go. Oh, whoops. Oh, something's happening up there. Okay, no skill. Okay, info. Info. Fist strength. 1,657 fist strength times two multiplier. Body toughness 1.1k, guys. 2.2k movement speed and 1.9k psychic power. This is incredible. Guys, we're going to hand in this quest and see, see what he's going to give us. I think we're going to unlock some kind of new ability. Click here to talk. Hello now. I'm sure you can run on water. Oh my god, we can run on water now. Also, you can enable and disable it in the reflection option menu, just like the damage reflection. Uh, wait, what? I don't know what I just said. I think it made sense. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> now you are very fast compared to when I met you for the first time, but you still lack one of the most important components of superpower movement. Okay, it's the jump force with a high jump force. You can effectively chase or escape your opponents because you'll be a dead target if you can only run fast but jump low. Oh, I almost forgot. You can use the same technique when you practice water running without the help of the heavy weight on your body. It'd take a while for you to reach the ground. I will only teach you the next move when you are able to jump higher than that building. Wait, what? What? Uh, what building? What, what's he all about? Hang on a sec. Okay, guys, <laughs> we're going to finish this Jump Force quest in the next episode. Thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode so far, if you're enjoying Superpower Simulator, if you if, if you want to see more content of Superpower Simulator on the channel, guys, smash the heck out of the like button. Comment down below if you've enjoyed this, guys, and make sure you comment 10 facts about yourself, 10 separate comments, facts about yourself in the comment section if you want to shout out in the next video. Subscribe and turn notifications on if you're new around here, guys. And, of course, I will see you in the next freaking banger on the channel. Here's one you might actually enjoy as well, guys. Until then, peace out.